At eight years of age, this little boy from the acreage has been through what most adults will never endure in a lifetime. But playtime with a famous rapper seemed to make it all go away. Thomas Messamino recently underwent a heart transplant to save his life. So far, so good. And he wanted to celebrate with none other than local resident and superstar, Vanilla Ice. CBS 12's Juan Carlos Fanjuel is just back from Wellington with the story all new at 6. Juan Carlos. That's right, Liz. Rob Van Winkle is a busy guy these days, reviving his career with a TV show and new music. But everything came to a stop for a young boy who simply wanted to meet him. You Shooting off a can of silly string on Elvis while playing with his new pal, Vanilla Ice, is a dream come true for eight-year-old Thomas Massimino, a child who has been through so much, including four major surgeries after being born with a genetic heart defect. Thomas was born with a condition called hypoplastic left heart syndrome. He was born with a half a heart. Basically, it was a series of three different surgeries from uh, his first one being at five days old. He got a heart transplant on Valentine's Day, and the Make-A-Wish Foundation decided to help lift up his spirits. First, meeting heavy metal band KISS, and now famed rapper and Wellington resident Rob Van Winkle, a.k.a. Vanilla Ice, who took him around his neighborhood this afternoon. You can see the kid is doing great now. At one point, they didn't know whether he was going to make it or not. You know, dad's struggling, and... Uh... It's been hard for a lot of people involved in that. Van Winkle with camera crews in tow show the boy a house he's remodeling as part of his upcoming DIY network show, The Vanilla Ice Project. So how did you feel meeting Vanilla Ice today? Good. Yeah? What was the most exciting part about it? Spring. Thomas is a man of few words, but if his huge smile today is any indication, he was having the time of his life along with his new and famous best friend. It's not about me, man. It's about him, you know, and uh, I'm just happy to be, you know, the puppet put here to basically make this happen for this kid. All right, now, a few days ago, we told you how Van Winkle was trying to drive a car through a flaming ring of fire at a motocross park in uh, Fort Pierce. Well, the event that was canceled due to a lack of permit. Well, now he is working on getting a permit to invite the entire community out. The event will be a fundraiser for Make-A-Wish and Toys for Tots. Of course, we'll let you know as soon as he gets a date. Juan Carlos Fanjul, CBS 12 News.